Ladies and gentlemen, you see, fear is not something to be ashamed of. It's not an enemy, but a signal that you're pushing yourself in ways you haven't before. Let me tell you something. Every time you feel afraid, you're standing on the edge of something great. Fear is a companion, not a barrier. It means you're about to do something that will challenge you, something that has the potential to change the course of your life. Think about the times when you've been scared and yet you pushed through it. What happened after? You learned something about yourself that you didn't know. You proved to yourself that fear doesn't get to decide your future, you do. Now, let me make it clear, fear is natural. It's a human thing. It's something we all face. But here's the difference. The truly successful people, the ones who go on to do incredible things, aren't the ones who never experience fear. No, they're the ones who face it head on, who use it as fuel to move forward, not something that holds them back. What happens when you embrace fear instead of running from it? You build confidence. Every single time you make that choice, it becomes easier. You begin to see that fear is just a sign that you're on the right path. The fear doesn't go away, you grow stronger. You build resilience, you see that fear is not the thing stopping you, but the thing pushing you into greatness. I felt fear. I stood on the edge, not knowing whether I could succeed. But I made a decision, a choice that's not easy for everyone to make. I didn't let fear stop me. I took that step, even though I was scared. And you know what? That's when things started to change. That's when I started to grow. Fear often shows up when we're about to do something that takes us beyond our comfort zone. And that's exactly where you need to be. Nothing extraordinary happens when you stay comfortable. Greatness demands you get uncomfortable, that you push past what feels safe and easy. There's a world waiting for you on the other side of fear, but you've got to be willing to walk through it. And here's the truth, you'll never fully be ready. You'll never have all the answers or feel completely prepared, but that's okay. The best things in life don't come from being perfectly prepared, they come from jumping in from taking risks, and from believing that you're capable of handling whatever comes your way. So I want you to remember this fear is not your enemy. Fear is a teacher. It's showing you where you need to go next. And if you face it, if you step up and take action anyway, you'll start to realize that you are stronger than you ever thought possible. Fear is there to test your resolve, and if you can push through it, you'll come out on the other side, a new version of yourself, one that doesn't back down, one that moves forward no matter the obstacles. This is how you begin to embrace the challenge. You stop seeing fear as a roadblock and start seeing it as a signpost pointing you toward growth. The more you face that fear, the more you'll learn about your strength. Don't let fear control your life. Let it motivate you. Let it propel you into the person you are meant to be. And remember, you don't have to be fearless. You just have to be willing to take that step, despite the fear. That's how you start living. That's how you start thriving. I want you to understand these challenges are not things that break you. They are the very things that make you. The truth is, if you run from challenges, you're running from the opportunity to grow, to get better, to push yourself further than you ever thought possible. Challenges are the universe's way of saying you've got more in you. You're capable of more than you even know. They push you to be better, to show up stronger, and to test your limits. Now, I'm not saying challenges are easy. No, they're tough. They can be painful. They will make you question yourself. But here's the thing. The hardest challenges, they teach you the most. They teach you about your strength, your resilience, and what you're truly made of. You see, when you embrace a challenge, you're not just facing an obstacle, you're stepping into an opportunity to transform. That's what challenges do for you. They bring out the greatness that you didn't even know you had inside of you. I faced my own challenges, trust me. There were times when I felt like I wasn't enough, like I wasn't going to make it. But I didn't let those challenges define me. I didn't let them tell me I couldn't do it. Instead, I used those moments as fuel. I took that pain that struggle, and I turned it into power. 
and I know that you can do the same thing. Every challenge is a lesson. Every challenge is an invitation to become better. Every challenge gives you the chance to discover new strengths that you didn't even realize were there. But here's the key, you've got to stop running from the discomfort. You've got to stop seeking the easy path. If you're looking for a way to avoid challenges, you're looking in the wrong direction. The easy road won't lead you to greatness. It's the hard road, the one that forces you to dig deep, to fight, and to keep going when you want to give up. That's the road that leads you to your best self. And let me tell you, the moment you start embracing challenges, the moment you decide that you're not going to let fear or doubt hold you back, that's when the transformation begins. It's in those moments when you face adversity head on that you start to tap into your true potential. Challenges don't break you, they reveal who you are. They show you the depth of your strength and the power you have to overcome anything. You're not defined by the challenges you face, you're defined by how you respond to them. Will you run away or will you step forward ready to take on what's in front of you? When you choose to embrace the challenge, you choose to grow. You choose to move forward and you choose to be the kind of person who looks at obstacles and says, I'm ready, let's do this. So I want you to stop avoiding the tough stuff. Embrace the challenge even when it scares you, even when it feels impossible. That's when the real magic happens. That's when you realize you are capable of far more than you ever imagined. You've got this, whatever challenge you face, know that you are stronger than it, you are tougher than the struggle, and you are more than enough to handle whatever comes your way. When you embrace challenges, you embrace your greatness. Keep pushing, keep striving, and never forget that you are meant for this. Let me tell you something, the fear of failure is real. I get it. You've been knocked down, told you're not good enough, made mistakes, and maybe even faced rejection. But here's the truth, failing is not the end. It's just the beginning. I've been there, I've failed more times than I can count. But every single time I learned something valuable, every single time I got back up and tried again, because I knew that failure wasn't the end of my story, it was just a part of the process. The key to success isn't avoiding failure, it's learning how to fail forward. When you let the fear of failure control you, it keeps you stuck. It keeps you in a place where you're too scared to try to take that next step, to push yourself beyond what's comfortable. But the truth is, you can't win without taking risks. You can't achieve greatness without stepping outside of your comfort zone. And you can't grow if you don't make mistakes along the way. Failure is not your enemy, it's your teacher. It's the process of growth, of becoming better, stronger, and more resilient. Think about it, how many successful people do you know who didn't face failure? The truth is they've all failed, but they didn't let it define them. They didn't let failure make them quit. They took what they learned, got up, and kept moving forward. You've got to do the same thing. When you fail, don't see it as the end of the road. See it as a chance to get back up, stronger and smarter. Every failure is a lesson in what doesn't work, and with each lesson, you get closer to what does. And let me be clear, failure is not about being less than or not good enough. No failure is about finding a new way, a better way. It's about discovering the parts of yourself you didn't know were there. It's about pushing yourself beyond your limits and realizing that your potential is so much greater than you ever thought possible. Failure shows you what you're made of. It shows you what you can handle, what you can overcome, and what you can achieve if you refuse to quit. The key is to keep going. I know it's hard. I know it's discouraging. But you've got to keep going. When you fall, when you fail, when you face obstacles, remember this, you are not defined by your failures. You are defined by your ability to rise up, to keep fighting, to keep pushing forward. It's that relentless drive to keep going, even when it feels impossible, that will lead you to success. So the next time you're faced with failure, don't be afraid of it. Don't let it hold you back. Embrace it. Learn from it. And then keep moving forward. 
Failure doesn't mean you're not capable. It just means you're on the path. It means you're trying. And trying, even in the face of setbacks, is what makes you a winner. You've got what it takes. You're strong enough to overcome any failure. You're resilient enough to bounce back. And you're powerful enough to turn every setback into a comeback. Don't let fear of failure control you. Embrace it. Learn from it and rise higher than you ever thought possible. Because the real failure is not trying. The real failure is giving up. And you, my friend, are never giving up. You're just getting started. You see, life will throw you curve balls. It's not if, it's when. The challenges, the setbacks, the tough moments, they'll come. But it's how you handle them that separates the winners from the quitters. You've got to develop a mindset that says, I don't care how many times I get knocked down, I'm getting back up. That's what it takes to truly win in life. It's not about being perfect. It's not about avoiding pain or struggles. It's about how you respond to them, how you rise every single time you fall. Life isn't easy, and that's the truth. You're going to go through seasons that will test your patience, your resilience, your faith in yourself. But let me tell you this, that's when your true power is revealed. When the storms come, they show you what you're made of. When the winds blow, they test your foundation. It's in these moments that you have to dig deep and remind yourself I'm stronger than I think. I'm capable of more than I know. I faced my share of struggles, my share of hardships. But every single one of those moments taught me something important about myself. It taught me that I'm stronger than I give myself credit for. It taught me that I can handle way more than I thought I could. And I'm telling you right now, you can handle it too. Whatever you're going through, whatever you're facing, you have the strength to overcome it. Here's the thing about challenges, they don't define you. You define you. It's not what happens to you that determines your future. It's how you choose to respond to it. Life is going to keep testing you but you have to keep fighting back. Every challenge is an opportunity. It's an opportunity to grow, to improve, to become more than you were yesterday. Don't let life's obstacles make you think you can't keep moving forward. It's not about being knocked down. It's about how quickly you get up and keep going. And believe me, every time you get back up, you're stronger, you're more resilient, and you're closer to your breakthrough. You've got to understand this life's challenges are not there to destroy you. They're there to build you. Every time you face something difficult and choose to keep going, you're building your character, your courage, and your strength. The tough moments are the moments that shape you into who you are meant to become. They're the moments that force you to look inside yourself and discover the strength you never knew you had. Now, you might be thinking, that sounds good, but I don't know if I can keep going, and I get that. But you've already been through tough times before. You've already faced challenges, and you made it through. You've already shown yourself that you can survive and come out stronger on the other side. So don't doubt yourself now. Don't doubt your strength. You've got everything you need to keep moving forward. Here's the final truth. It's not about how many times you get knocked down. It's about how many times you rise back up. Life will throw everything it can at you, but you have the power to rise above it. So keep going, keep pushing, keep believing in yourself. You are stronger than you think, and you are more than capable of overcoming whatever challenges life puts in your way. So when those tough moments come, and they will remind yourself of this, you were made for this. You were made to rise, and you're just getting started. Let me tell you something. In this life, you're going to encounter challenges. You can't avoid them no matter how hard you try. And guess what? That's okay. Life isn't supposed to be all smooth sailing. If it was, you wouldn't grow. You wouldn't become the person you're meant to be. The struggles, the battles, they're not there to break you, but to make you stronger. When you face challenges, they shape you. They mold you into a version of yourself that is more capable more resilient, more powerful than you ever imagined. So, 
The real question is, how do you handle those challenges? When life hits you hard, do you stay down or do you get back up and fight with everything you've got? That's where the real power lies. It's in your ability to rise every single time you fall. That's where your greatness is born. It's in your ability to keep pushing no matter how many setbacks, no matter how many obstacles. You see, the power isn't in avoiding pain. The power isn't in trying to dodge the tough moments. The power is in how you respond to those tough moments. Life's not about being invincible, it's about being resilient. Life is going to knock you down, it's going to test you, and it's going to push you to your limit. But here's the thing, you're stronger than you think. Every single time you get back up, you prove that you have the strength to face anything that comes your way. It's easy to quit. It's easy to throw in the towel when things get tough, when the road gets hard. But what makes you different, what makes you unstoppable is when you decide to keep going, when you decide that no matter how tough things get, you are going to keep moving forward. And trust me, that's where the magic happens. That's when you unlock your true potential. There's something powerful about the human spirit. When you've been through enough, when life has tried to break you, you start to realize your own strength. You start to see the power that lies within you. It's easy to doubt yourself when everything is going wrong, when nothing seems to be going your way. But the truth is, the strength you need to keep moving forward is already inside of you. You've always had it. You just had to trust yourself enough to let it out. But here's the real key. You can't wait for life to get easier. You can't wait for the perfect moment, for the right circumstances. There's no such thing. You've got to make the decision right now to rise up, to take action, to move forward with confidence, even when you don't have all the answers. Life's not waiting for you to be ready. It's challenging you to get ready to show up and to fight with everything you have. And yeah, sometimes you might feel like you're not making progress, like the road is too hard. But understand this every step you take, no matter how small, is a step toward your growth. Every moment you push through, every time you refuse to give up, you're building your strength. Every time you refuse to stay down, you are proving to yourself just how powerful you really are. So don't get discouraged. Don't let the challenges define you. You define them. When life tries to knock you down, you stand up taller. When the weight feels heavy, you carry it with grace. You don't let the challenges control you. You control how you respond to them. And you respond with power, with resilience, with strength. In the end, it's not the challenges that matter. It's how you rise from them, how you grow through them, how you refuse to be defeated. That's where your true strength lies. So the next time life throws something your way, remember this, you're not just surviving, you're thriving. You're stronger than you think. And nothing is going to stop you from becoming the person you were always meant to be. Listen, there's something I want you to understand. Your mindset is everything. When you change the way you think, you change the way you live. The greatest challenges in life come when you shift your thinking from I can't to I can from this is too hard to, I'm capable of overcoming this. It's about shifting your perspective, realizing that the way you view yourself, the way you approach your obstacles is the key to your growth. And here's the truth. You have everything you need inside you to rise above your challenges. The real battle is between your ears. You see, so many people get caught in the trap of negative thinking. They tell themselves they're not good enough. They're not strong enough that they don't have what it takes to overcome what's in front of them. And the worst part is they believe it. They internalize their doubts and those doubts become their reality. But you have the power to flip the script. You have the power to stop limiting yourself with negative thoughts. It all starts with your belief in yourself. The most powerful tool you'll ever have is your mindset. You can't control what happens to you, but you can control how you respond. You can control how you perceive the world around you. Every time life hits you with a challenge, it's an opportunity for you to grow. It's a test to see how much you truly believe in yourself, how much you trust your ability to rise no matter what. And I promise you this, you are capable. 
you have the strength within you to handle whatever comes your way. But here's the kicker. You can't just think it. You have to live it. You have to walk the talk. It's not enough to say, I believe in myself and expect the world to change for you. No, you've got to put in the work. You've got to take the steps necessary to change, to evolve, to overcome. That means when the road gets tough, when the obstacles seem too high, you keep pushing. When things aren't going your way, you don't stop. You don't throw in the towel, you keep going. It's about how you carry yourself through the struggles. Every challenge you face is an opportunity to prove to yourself that you are stronger than you thought. It's about taking the hits, taking the punches, and standing back up no matter how many times it happens. Because when you stand back up, you show yourself in the world that you are unbreakable. And that belief, that confidence, that drive, it doesn't come from the outside. It comes from within. It comes from your ability to trust in your own power. Now, let me tell you something. There's no easy way out. There's no magic pill that's going to make everything easier. Life is hard, and there's no escaping that. But you don't need things to be easier. You need to be stronger. You need to have the courage to keep going even when you feel like giving up. When you change your mindset, you begin to see things differently. You begin to realize that every struggle, every challenge is just a step in your growth. You can't let fear or doubt define you. You can't let it stop you from being who you were meant to be. You can't let negativity control your life. You've got to stop waiting for the world to be perfect and start embracing your own strength. Stop waiting for things to be easier and start believing that you're capable of handling them. Life doesn't owe you anything, but you have the ability to make the most of it. So here's what you need to do every time life throws something your way. Respond with confidence. Respond with belief. Respond with the understanding that you can handle whatever comes your way. And as you keep doing this, you'll realize something important. You'll realize that there's nothing in this world that can break you. You are stronger than you think, and with the right mindset, there is no challenge you can't conquer. Keep pushing forward, and remember your greatest power is how you choose to think, how you choose to respond, and how you choose to live.